flu season rages on, and there are signs that we still have not seen the worst of it. More than 60 children have died from the virus, and one in 13 doctor visits last week was for flu-like symptoms. But there's hope thanks to new drugs and technologies that the flu outbreak like this one could soon become a thing of the past. Hannah Doba explains. With the CDC reporting one in 10 deaths in the U.S. is currently due to influenza or pneumonia, tragic stories are a nearly daily occurrence. Among the latest victims, a five-year-old girl from Brooklyn. Neighbors describe in heartbreaking detail seeing her desperate mother. She was sitting on the floor with her, you know, holding her daughter, creating her daughter. And she was just trying to tell her daughter, wake up, please don't leave me. This flu season, already one of the worst on record, may actually not have peaked yet. But there is news of potentially cutting-edge new treatments. Among the experimental drugs showing some promise, one from Japanese pharmaceutical company Shianogi that has killed the flu in a single day with a single dose. Because it stops it from multiplying, other cells don't get infected, other people don't get infected. The drug and others that hold potential, if fast-tracked for FDA approval, would hit shelves at the earliest next flu season. And Adoba, CBS News. Doctors say that even though the flu shot is just about 30% effective this year, they're urging everyone to get it. Even if it doesn't cover every strain, the flu shot could help with symptoms. It is 6 -20.